The owner of a San Francisco restaurant famous for hosting politicians claims Sen. Bernie Sanders lost his vote in the 2020 presidential election after the Vermont Democratic candidate was rude and cranky to his servers, a report said. John Constant, who owns the 111-year-old John's Grill, told Politico many Democrats dined at his bistro while the Democratic National Committee was in town for a three-day event over the weekend, Sanders arrived for dinner with about 15 members of his campaign team and was not nice to any of the staff and didn't want to shake hands or have his picture taken, he added. Sanders slams McConnell's cowardice in fiery visit to top Republicans' home state of Kentucky, it was all very nice, except for cranky Bernie, Constant told Politico. I think he was just hungry and didn't want to be a politician. He lost my vote, Sanders' campaign did not respond to a request for comment from Fox News. Lee Housekeeper, the media contact for John's Grill, told SFGate.com that it's uncharacteristic for Constant to speak ill of his restaurant patrons. Bernie had to be in a terrible mood, Housekeeper said. Anyone in the public eye needs to understand when it's time to order room service, Constant told Politico that staff waiting on other Democrats, including one large party with the Secretary of State of California Alex Padilla, Lieutenant Governor of California Eleni Kunalakis, and House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, had a more pleasant experience. He described Pelosi as pure class. John's Grill opened its doors in 1908 and was famously featured in Dashiell Hammett's 1930 noir film, The Maltese Falcon, SFGate.com reported. The restaurant is popular among politicos and has pictures of politicians who've visited the establishment hanging on its wooden walls. Click here to get the Fox News app 13 presidential candidates attended the DNC meeting in San Francisco over the weekend, Sen. Elizabeth Warren, D. Mass, dined out with her staff at San Francisco's Ayala restaurant in the Union Square Hotel when she visited the city in June, SFGate.com reported. She was absolutely wonderful and came into our kitchen, Ayala General Manager Alexandra Lulias told the website. So complimentary of our staff. She took individual photos with everyone. Just the nicest lady. Let's block ads. Why?